Deep in the heart of the Pacific Ocean, a monstrous creature lurked beneath the waves. It was a kaiju, a giant behemoth of a monster, with razor-sharp teeth and deadly claws. Its skin was as black as night, and its eyes glowed with an eerie red light. The kaiju had been awakened by a powerful earthquake that had shaken the ocean floor, and now it was hungry. It began to swim towards the nearest landmass, its massive body creating a wake that could be seen from miles away. As the kaiju drew closer to the shore, the people living in the coastal town began to panic. They had heard stories of kaiju before, but they had never seen one with their own eyes. They watched in horror as the creature emerged from the water, towering over the tallest buildings in the city. The kaiju began to rampage through the town, destroying everything in its path. It swatted away helicopters and military jets as if they were nothing, and crushed cars and buildings under its massive feet. The people tried to run, but there was nowhere to hide from the wrath of the kaiju. The military was called in, but their weapons were no match for the giant monster. Bullets bounced off its tough skin, and missiles exploded harmlessly on impact. The kaiju seemed to be unstoppable, and the people began to lose hope. As night fell, the kaiju continued its rampage, its glowing eyes casting an eerie light over the destroyed city. The survivors huddled in shelters, praying for a miracle. Just when all seemed lost, a group of scientists came up with a plan to stop the kaiju. They had discovered that the monster was vulnerable to a certain frequency of sound, and they had built a device that could emit that sound at a high enough volume to kill the kaiju. The scientists set up the device at the edge of town, and waited for the kaiju to approach. As the monster drew near, they activated the device, and the air was filled with a deafening sound that shook the ground. The kaiju roared in agony, its body writhing in pain. Its eyes flickered, and then went out, and the monster fell to the ground, dead. The survivors emerged from their hiding places, shocked but relieved that the nightmare was finally over. But they knew that they would never forget the terror of the kaiju, and that they would always live in fear of another monster emerging from the depths of the ocean.